The chief of UNICEF Lagos Field Office, Celine Lafosser, says once the target of e-birth registration was met in Nigeria, it will be a game changer as it will also help government to generate valid statistics for planning. He said this virtually at a two-day media dialogue on e-birth registration on Tuesday. The media dialogue was organized by UNICEF in collaboration with the National Population Commission and other partners. The chief of UNICEF field office said that e-birth was important to give every child the right to have an identity that he or she deserves. For UNICEF and for everyone around the world, this is a child's right. It's everyone, every child's right to have a legal identity. It is very key. Um, it is not simply a procedural formality. It is a fundamental human right, as I explain, and the cornerstone, sorry, of a child's legal identity. Without that, the child remains available, uh, remains invisible. A registered child has acknowledged rights to uh, protection, but also to health care, education, and other critical services. Lefusser said that e-birth registration should be a right of every child from birth. She said that the e-bird registration was very important to national planning and development in the country. She noted that the use of accurate data remained crucial for any country. Registration is a formidable opportunity um, to get more children uh, registered and have a legal identity. Why? Because it cuts off the issues of geographic distance. It makes it easier for parents to, um, to register their children as soon as they're born. Um, it's an innovative approach. It stands truly as a game changer for a country like Nigeria, which is a huge country. The Media Dialogue has its team, a Media Dialogue to drive e-birth registration in Southwest Nigeria.